Here, Pippin's pregame alongside manager Marcus McKimmy in a playoff version of Pippin's pregame as we get set for game one of the South Divisional round. The Pippins taking on the Corvallis Knights. Game one here at Yakima County Stadium, two and three would be in Corvallis. And the, uh, we've talked about it all season long. It's about getting to this point. The team did it. It certainly wasn't easy. Had to go on a couple of tiebreakers. We were waiting until the very end. But uh, talk me through what, what you're most proud of about the team this season, how they're able to actually get to this point where they can now host a playoff game and try to try to win it all, obviously. Well, we're 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 not finished. You you know, this, what's great about this group is they're not satisfied just being here. You know, this was just a step on the journey uh, that, you know, and part of the expectation. But, yeah, they're, they're relentless. You know, we've got, we've got four to go, and, and tonight's just, just one stop on that bus. Now, this is a, a Pippins franchise. I know you've been the coach. You've been the coach for now four playoff games. Talk to me about how that experience can help you out a little bit in managing these games because I know that the team has not won a playoff game. At the same time, every group is different. Take me through how you take that experience into now uh, another situation where you have a playoff game to coach here tonight. Yeah, it's it's uh, it's, it's having some background with the league and, and the process and, and some perspective obviously helps being able to reiterate some of those things that, that we've learned as a staff uh, to our players. Uh, but but with these guys, you know the me the message is, is still the same, and you know you got to play well to win. You know it's an, you know the the base length hasn't changed. You know the distance you throw from the mound and and the the atmosphere, you know it, is is the same. So for us, uh, it, it's a matchup. It's a matchup situation, and and with 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 Dollard on the mound today, we're we're just going at it one game at a time. Why don't we go right there because he's obviously been sensational. The reigning West Coast League pitcher of the week now, six wins for you guys, and I think his seven appearances, uh, five starts he's made. He's been so good. Uh, talk about what, what makes him so effective. I know last time out against this Corvallis team he had the hand that built a blister injury, but uh, what, what does he need to do to be effective here tonight? He just he needs to trust the stuff. He needs to be be a bulldog in the strike zone, and uh, that that's what he's been all summer. So uh, setting the setting the tone early, uh, get us in the dugout, and a chance to a chance to be aggressive offensively is, is all all that we ask. And and for him, just to to enjoy the moment and trust his stuff. And final thing for you guys, obviously having played Corvallis six times this year, they won four of them, but you guys out hit them in five of those six games. I know we talked about two out execution, the little things, losing late leads in the seventh, eighth innings. But what needs to change in these couple games to get a few wins here? Well, that's just it. I mean, the games are in the balance. You know, it's you got you got to you've got to execute. You got to make plays. And what's what's great about sports and team sports is players make plays. You know, we can talk about it all day here, but, you know, the guys between the lines are, are going to have to, uh, you know, do do what they've been coached to do and, and confidently trust what, what they're really good at. And that's that's what makes our job so fun, man. You get you, you get here and, and you get to really see uh, the guys, you know, get what they earn and, and compete at the highest level, and, and that's, uh, that's ultimately what it's all about. Well, the Pippins hosting game one in the South Divisional Series here tonight. First pitch at 7.05. Taylor Dollard will be on the mound. Pippins looking for that first playoff win in franchise history.